This video is going to discuss the ambiguity of George Romero's underappreciated vampire classic, Martin. Is Martin truly an 80-year-old vampire, or is he just a delusional youth? There are arguments on both sides, although Romero had a pretty definite opinion himself. Kuda, the old world cousin who Martin comes to stay with, believes that his cousin is indeed a vampire and employs all sort of traditional folklore against his cousin before realizing that Martin isn't affected by these relics. Also, Martin has several flashbacks. Are these delusions or actual instances of his past? Is Martin truly a vampire or is he just the victim of a genetic disease passed down through the ages? A disease that compels him to kill and drink human blood. And how deeply does Kuda share this belief? No matter what side of the debate you stand on, you can't argue that with Martin, George Romero created a ferociously original and enduring piece of vampire fiction rivaled only by Richard Matheson's I Am Legend.